Now, the day of the presentation, it's really, really, really important. Again, I learned this from performing music, warm up your body. The voice is a instrument and the voice can really matter when it comes to your presentation. If you haven't properly warmed up, if you have an early morning presentation and you come out of bed and you grab your cup of coffee and you just go out there and you try to croak out whatever you're trying to say, it won't come across with the same level of engagement as if your body, your especially your breath support, is really warmed up and really ready to engage. So this is an incredibly important part of your presentation take time the morning of the afternoon of an hour two hours three hours five hours before your presentation just go for a walk a really vigorous walk maybe go for a run if you're a runner really get out there and get some physical uh, exercise but really if you're looking at your core what you need to warm up is your core and that'll help you go into that presentation with some feeling of bodily confidence. And if you're a singer, or if you've ever sang as in your profession, or even just in, as a hobby, uh, use those vocal exercises that you learned in choir or in whatever other uh, performance you did. Those breathing exercises, vocal exercises, can really come in handy and can help exercise your voice. So when you go out there, again, you have that feeling of confidence because you know your voice is ready to perform. This also goes for your face and your facial muscles. I think this is another thing that gets overlooked Every muscle in your face is an opportunity to communicate something about what you've done. And if you haven't warmed up all those little tiny facial muscles, your face won't be able to emote, won't be able to express what you're doing nearly as good as if you were uh, coming at it with a warmed up face muscles, I guess you could say. 